Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, and today I'll be doing my Game 3 tips and predictions for the State of Origin, and yes, State of Origin is finally here, Game 3, the third and final game of 2023, and yes, we're going to get straight into it, I'm going to do my tips, my prediction, first off my tip, and then we'll do my predictions of a try scorer and also the halftime score, so it's a big one. State of Origin is here today, 8.05 at the, Adel um, at the, sorry, uh, where is it at? It's, um... It's in, uh, it's in, it's in New South Wales. It is at um, Sydney, a call stadium in Sydney. So it's game three, New South Wales versus Queensland. Queensland have already won the series. They've won two o. They're up two o so far. They've won in. They won an Adelaide Oval in game one. Quick recap: game one, big win, twenty six eighteen in Adelaide, and then game two at Suncorp, thirty two to six win. That was a big win, and I did predict Hammer to score. And he did. So that was good there. That was a good tip. The New South Wales tip didn't really go down that way I wanted to. It was 10-0 to Queensland halftime. I did say, I think, 10-6 to New South Wales. But still, it was a good game there. So game three here, Queensland looking to sweep. Looking to go 3-0 and win the series. New South Wales do not want to go down 3-0. They want to at least get a win and not make Queensland sweep. Because I don't think Queensland has won a sweep since like 2010 or something. Something like that. Queensland have not won, it's been like 8 years, 18 years or something around that since um, they've won a sweep, so or even lost a sweep. So Queensland are really looking for a sweep. I would love to see Queensland sweep New South Wales and win it, the series like 3-0. So if you look at the starting lineups and we'll talk more in. So quick, the ins and outs. So there's a lot of ins and a lot of outs. For the big outs for New South Wales is Hudson Young, Jerome Luai, Junior Palo, Matt Burn, Payne Haas, um... Uh, Stephen O'Kamanu, uh, Tom DeVoyce, and Tyson Fidel. The outs for the Queensland is Reese Walsh due to uh, suspension, of course, around the Broncos of that, and Tom Flegler. So New South Wales are losing Jerome Luai, Payne Haas, Frizzell, Travojevic, Matt Burton, Paolo, Hudson Young. But they do get in Bradman Best, Gutherson Walker, Saifidi, Jake Travojevic, Keegan Klom, Matangi, Campbell Ring, uh, Regan Campbell Gillard, Dr Scott Drinkwater, and Spencer Lenu. We we also get in Tom Dearden, Jermaine Hopgood, and Corey Horsburgh. So for the backs for New South Wales, we got uh, for the fullback James Sesco is captain. The wingers Brian Totter and Josh Adakar, of course. Centers Stephen Crichton and Bradman Best. Now with Bradman Best, I'll get to them in a sec. Uh, halves you got Cody Walker and Mitchell Moses. In the forwards you got Jake Tavoyevic and Ring Campbell Gillard. Hooker you got Damien Cook. Second row, Liam Martin and Keegan Kalamatangi. And at the lock, you got Cameron Murray. The bench there, as you can see, is la la la. Queensland now, the fullback, AJ Brimson. Two wingers, Xavier Coates and Murray to a lungy. Centers, Val Holmes and Hamatabu Ifido, of course. Halves, Cameron Munster, Daly Cherry Evans, no, no questions. Reuben Cotter and Tino Fasula Malawi. And this uh, hooker, Harry Grant. Second row, David Fafida. And Jeremiah Nanai in the lock cap, Patrick Carrigan. There's the bench there. Ben Hunt coming off the bench. And Hooker, you've got Harry Grant starting. So quick things looking at here with the New South Wales team. Bringing in Bradman Best at, at, at number four. Losing Jake Tavoyevich from game two. Bradman Best, number four, is what New South Wales have chosen. Who in the world, where did he come in? Yes, he did score like three tries prior to game three in round 19 or 18. But still, I would. there's so many more guys out there. Like Campbell Graham, honestly. He's, I think, injured. But still, I think he's been playing amazing. I reckon Campbell Graham would have been a better fit. I think he was fine to be playing in this uh, game three. Bradman Best, I'm interested to see. If he plays amazing game three, then okay, well done. If New South Wales win and Bradman Best plays amazing, then okay, well done. But Bradman Best, I don't know about him, but we'll see how he goes uh, tonight. Uh, that's really all for New South Wales, but with the Queensland, you're starting Harry Grant over Ben Hunt, and that's a big call from Billy Slater. I'm really excited to see how Harry Grant will start, and also um, AJ Brimson coming up fullback. I think it's a good fit, great there. I would, I think Hammer is better in the centres for Queensland specifically, but for I think the Dolphins, I think Hammer is probably better at fullback. But that's how it is there. There it is. There's the lineups now. Who's my tip? Of course, I'm going to go Queensland. There's no doubt about that. Queensland all the way. They're going to sweep. They're going to win this game in three. I can New South Wales, I think, have a chance to at least push this game so it's actually a close game for once. But I reckon Queensland will easily win. They're going to win. They're 1-12 easy, I reckon. 1-12. to 12. 
and a half um, try scorer. We'll do a try scorer first. The try scorer for Queensland. I've, I've, I've got to keep Hammer on my books. I'm going to go Hammer. I do think he will score in all three games. I just believe Hammer, Hammer So Tabuai Fido is one of those players who you just can't keep your eye on. I think he's a target that for Queensland to keep winning. And I'm going to go Hammer. I, I, I can't I can't not go past the Hammer. So Hammer Wise Tabuai Fido will be scoring a try any time during this match. He might not. He might. He might not. But still. Anyway, having him on a bet, I reckon, is good. Hammer is going to score a try in halftime. Uh, New South Wales scorer. I think if, I think they'll go for one of the wingers to score. So I will. Pro I am probably going to go. Stephen Crichton has a chance. He hasn't been playing that way. So I'm going to go Josh Adekar. Let's put him out there. Josh Adekar. Oh no. The might go Stephen Crichton because they, Stephen Crichton might not pass one of the wingers. We'll go Stephen Crichton. Let's just put it out there. Hammer, Hammer so Tabuai Fido and Stephen Crichton, the two try scorers. I think I did that for game one, maybe. I think. I'll see. But that's what I'm going to go for. Stephen Crichton, Hammer Wai Tabuai Fido for the try scorers. And halftime score, I'm probably going to lean towards New South Wales leading at halftime, something around that. The scoreline will be very close. I'm going to predict like maybe a. 14 to 8 half time or 14 12 14 10 something like that. I'm gonna go 14 to 12 half time score. The a big first half I reckon 14 12 half time score and that's what we're gonna talk about. There it is. There's my tips. Half time score 14 12 two scorers Hammer and Stephen Crichton. Queensland a win. Queensland win pick up the shield tonight and win 3 0. Pretty easy. Pretty done deal and that is it. There's state of origin. The last state of origin video for this series, for this year. Stay, ne stay tuned for next year. State of Origin, I think tips will probably still be coming out. We shall see. Anyway, stay tuned now. I will do a round 20 tip and prediction video, so just do stay tuned for that when that comes out. But watch this, watch the Origin, and then go watch the round 20 tip video. Anyway, that is it. Until next time, guys, enjoy life and have fun. Enjoy the Origin, enjoy the footy, enjoy this week of footy anyway. See you guys. Have a good one.